Life is a journey. Hello. Defined not by a destination, but by the company we keep. Ma'am? I'm Elizabeth Thornton. Welcome to Hope Valley, Constable. I never served with your late husband, but by all accounts, he was an excellent Mountie. So? How was she? How was he? Allie, she's my niece. She was in your class today. I'm sorry, Allie. And how did you like Mrs. Thornton? So you know that this is her. Hi, Allie. Constable Grant! Oh, it's about Allie. I was hoping to talk to you. Okay, I'll come by. I believe she pushes people away before they have the chance to get close to her. Why would she do something like that? To protect herself. If she pushes people away, she doesn't have to worry about losing them. I know it isn't always easy raising a child on your own. Yes, it definitely has its challenges. As well as its joys. Yes. He talks about you a lot, too. Really? What's... What does he say? Rally's favorite teacher. Bribing a public official, Constable? Well, if you eat the evidence and nobody finds out. <laughs> I'm going to see Judge Avery about your adoption. Mrs. Thornton! Uncle Nathan's gonna start my adoption! Oh my goodness, Allie, that's so wonderful! Adopting Allie is the single best thing that I have ever done with my life. And I'll never understand why my sister married Dylan Parks, or how after Colleen passed, how he could run out on Allie. Haven't you ever lost someone so close to your heart? Tear two apart? Not yet. It would just hurt too much if I lost you the way I lost Jack. Elizabeth, look, I know you feel the same way that I do. I can't. Elizabeth, I'm in love with you. Elizabeth, I love you. Dad, he hardly even said hello when I got back. Sad. What? I thought that you just called me. Dad, is that okay? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's way better than okay. Wherever you feel most comfortable, that's where you belong. Like, here with you? Thank you for being there for me. Always. When did Allie start having questions about her mother? Uh, pretty much right out of the gate. Allie was four when Colleen passed, so... Right. I never knew my mom, but maybe I could know Dylan. Just don't shut your dad out, all right? He only wants what's best for you. I got a call from Granville Prison. Apparently Allie phoned him and requested a visit with Dylan. Dylan didn't want to see me. He's a fool for throwing away his chance at being your dad. Because his loss is my gain. Why? Is little Jack start to ask? But where's heaven? Well, heaven is up above us. And I know that may seem far away, but your daddy is also in our hearts. Here. 
And that's where he'll always be. That's a tough one. Shouldn't be. Obviously, I want him to know all about Jack. But how much do I tell him and when? Well, from where I sit, in my opinion, they'll let you know what they're ready for. Okay, I'll start. You hide. One, two, three. Just between us, Allie is afraid she's not going to get hired back. Which, which honestly, I totally get. I mean, losing a child in the first five minutes is pretty much against the job description. You can come out now. Dad! Clearly, she has good instincts. She kept a cool head. She summoned law enforcement. <laughs> Jack, if you were a little guy, where would you hide? Maybe somewhere only a little guy could fit. <clears throat> Found him. someone for my dad to marry. I'm sorry, what? I thought he wanted to marry you, and that would have been great, but to each their own, I suppose. Now she asked when I might get married. Uh, I'm sure she just wants you to be happy. No, what she wants is a little brother. Or sister. Well, you never know. No, you never know. But what I do know is that love is the greatest gift, since it can't be forced. Only freely given. I was just so afraid of getting hurt again. But I don't think I was listening to my heart. if we started spending more time with Allie and Mountie Nathan. Yay! <laughs> Miss Thornton and I. Dad, I know. Yeah, no, I know. But we, um... Well, I guess we are, A couple? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um... Yeah, I guess we are. Is that, is that okay with you? Of course! It's really nice seeing how happy she makes you. 